So welcome back guys to We Talk Boxing and today I'm going to be talking about the fight which has been announced between Chris Billum Smith versus Richard Riappor and this is going to be for their well for Chris Billum Smith's title I should have been able to say I was going to say their title then but anyhow um this is being confirmed for June the 15th and it's going to be taking place in London and it's going to be at the 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 home of um, Crystal Palace, Selhurst Park, and it's going to be for Chris Billum Smith's WBO title. Now, this sees the pair, you know, meeting for a second time as professionals. The first fight took place uh, back in 2019, and it was a, a close fight, especially on the scorecards. Uh, Richard Riakpo obviously got the nod. He got the main decision at the time. He did drop. He did drop um, Billum Smith. Billy Smith claims it was more of a flash knockdown, but he did drop him. Um, and it was a good, close, competitive contest between both of these guys at that, at, at that time in their career. Um, and it's quite weird because when I did watch that fight live and I kind of felt as if it was maybe a little bit of a premature fight between both of these guys because I saw both of these guys as good prospects for the future. Um, and it is to be where we are now. And this is why we are here now because... Both of these guys have gone on since then and um, done amazingly in their careers. And if you look at if you look if you look at Chris Billum Smith compared to where he was, obviously he lost to Richard Riappor, and he's just gone from strength to strength. And he obviously has claimed a version of the world title, um, and is yeah, he's is 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 smashed it really. He's done he's done exceptionally well. Whereas Richard Riappor, on the other hand, he hasn't obviously claimed a major uh, version of the of, of of the world title yet, but he has obviously been in there with some good decent opponents um since chris billum smith and he's currently 17 and all with 13 kills to his name so he is a massive massive puncher but it's just a case of um how far could he go and obviously i will give my uh opinion in regards to who i feel will win this fight but as i'm sitting here now and talking about this fight being confirmed yesterday i'm gonna say i'm gonna edge more towards Richard Riappor and I don't feel as if Richard Riappor will win on points I feel as if at, at some point he might get a stoppage against Chris Billum Smith he didn't manage the stoppage in the first fight and that's because Chris Billum Smith has good skills is you know what I mean he's got good work rate good energy good combinations and he obviously made the fight a lot harder um than what Richard Riappor um thought it was going to be at that time because he, he obviously did knock him down and he potentially thought that was going to be it, Richard Riappor. But yeah, I just feel that Richard's obviously developed, he's progressed in his career, he's adding, he's adding new skills and he's still carrying that power. So I feel as if with the new skills that he's got and the power that he contains, I feel as if he may get to um, Chris Bill and Smith at some point in that 12 rounds. However, if this fight does go the distance, my money's on Chris Billum Smith all day long. Only because, as I said, he has got the he has got the skills to make any fighter in this division um, awkward in terms of their boxing the skills and his work rate is exceptional and he is quite durable. You got to admit he is quite durable. He's took some big big shots against some big big opponents. So yeah, it's going to be a good fight and a fight that I am looking forward to. So let's just wait and see what happens and. You guys can let me know your thoughts. Who would you consider the favourite in this fight? Would it be Chris Billum Smith or Richard Riappor? And by what method? Is it going to be a knockout, points victory or referee stoppage? As always, guys, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Bless. Mm -hmm.